to Pixel Lady Geek presents Pixel Play. Uh, my name is James Honeycutt. I'm here with JJ Krauss. And we are bringing you Lego Worlds in Scene early switch. access. Team yes. switch to game capture. So, uh, Lego Worlds is a early access title uh, developed by Traveler's Tales, which, um, I mean, frankly, they've developed every Lego game. Don't know. I want to say everyone ever, but certainly in recent history. I'm, um, I'm very interested to to see how this works. Uh, frankly speaking, I um, I can't believe that it's taken. Yeah, uh, duh. Go with that. I can't believe it's taken them this long. Um, when Minecraft was first in like early alpha, and I jumped into it because everybody, everybody was talking about it. Um, I thought when describing it to other people that the the best way to do it was just to say like it's legos like think about think about the fact that like it's legos like everything's built with a block and a block constitutes everything and there are different kinds of blocks um and so it amazes me that it's taken this long for lego to move in that direction um the only thing that i can think is maybe there were some legal issues but it is essentially Lego in Minecraft. And that's a great, like, that is an amazing idea. Um, now, you've been playing it for a while, uh, and incidentally, pick any world you want to. Go I think this one with a while, because it looks really cool. Right. Yeah, I've been playing it for about two hours. Okay. Some change. Okay, and what are what are your... <laughs> Can you land on the... <laughs> Okay, so first and foremost, uh, if you look at it, it's I mean, a, it's gorgeous. Yeah, like look at the just the detail on that. Every little, I can see the little rough. I'm pointing at the screen, but the little rough detail that's on that yeah. actual piece. That's what I'm talking about. Like, yeah, like it's a pretty game. It yeah. it really is. It is a re it it really is a very beautiful game. And it, you know, I think initially I was a little bit concerned because it didn't run incredibly well in this system and the system is something of a horse um but i guess that makes sense because there's a lot of intricacy in it first and foremost you can see a lot of post-processing there's a lot of lighting work in it that you wouldn't expect in a title like this but also if you compare it to minecraft and it's it's going to be impossible for people not to there's a tremendous amount more that they're dealing with. The individual physical elements are much tinier, much more intricate. Um, so you're dealing with a lot more in the universe, and there's also a lot more going on. I mean, you just jump on a horse. Well, actually, you, you know, know what? We're going to get a polar bear. Because why would you not get a polar bear? Um, I just that just got very and serious. Yeah, you you um you can build in this game, but you also find objects by running into them or fighting them. Okay. Um, kind of okay. like I so did with mushroom. Are you or, are you learning a formula when you do that, or are you actually collecting you get to, an item? You collect the pegs like you do in normal Lego games. Okay. And you can buy said objects. So actually, this person where did she? Okay. Now where, uh, this is a AI okay, character. Man. Yes. Oh, right. the, yeah. So okay. after meeting him, I can event I can buy his skin, but I can also attack him with. Bear, which you better do, do that because he's, he's. Why would you have a bullet? Oh, no, bear I'll just put this to cuffs. Come on. Yeah, this. Yep. This really is stunning. Those are treasure chests. Yes. So, oh, these aren't the important ones. These just have pegs. Um, there are, there are ones. more important ones that come with items like rocket launchers or. When, uh, when you say rocket launcher, I mean rocket launcher. Okay, that um, I, I feel like that should be relatively high in the sword. priority list. Let me see. Boop. Boop. Uh, and I'm doing the cutscene. Okay. See. Not only that, like, so we can do some building or let's see. Whoa. Terrifying. Let's see. Uh, so one thing we should say about this, I I think that this is an absolutely absolutely awful interface system. Yeah. I do I do not like the way it. What are you doing floating around? Getting rid of that tree. What are you tree. doing? What are you doing? Pulling a reverse Bob Ross. This is Getting nuts. rid of the tree. No. Getting rid of the tree. No, that tree does not live there. Mm -hmm. That There is not a happy little tree that exists no. in that space. No. Um, so the pink that we're looking oh. at there, is that a, is it a error? Is no, it these are just other two cents. Okay. Um, actually, here, right here, in this building right here, there might be a chest for us and where we can get an item. 
So that's the building. Okay, so the the world that we looked at, like it was it was this huge like elliptical disc, um, elliptical from one side disc from another. Sorry. Um, is that the entirety of the area? Does it? I mean, does it create like an entire world or just a? From what I've seen, that's what you get to see so far, and then you can explore. And there's more. There's some, kind of like you know little biomes and yeah. So there's like that. Okay. Uh, I like this. You you punch the shit out of that chest. You I meant to that. open it. Do, 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 you an got apple. a thing. We got an apple. Um, He's got a. All right. What because else? of that, let's just let's you just know, destroy this it. building. Oh, so that was like one of those, uh, that was like a, Jap like, Japanese-themed yep. building. Uh, uh, and I don't think they're going to be using licensed um, ones, obviously, but from what it seems like, they're going to be using, like, the creator sets and things that they own. Hold up. So you're saying Knights of the Realm will be in this, like the castle one? There is the king. <gasps> you can actually get his crown. Oh, okay. Um, you can get his uh, other stuff. Can I've, you? I've come across, um, in mine, I have the giant drill truck, and here's a motorcycle. This um, this is quickly becoming the the best idea. I mean, they just it, it was it's already a no brainer. Like this is just like a duh. Like, this is a th <gasps> you're moving into a different bio. Yeah, oh, 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 and there's the yeti. You better, you better do it. You better do it. So yeah, I'm having. What did you just break? A gigantic uh, icicle yeah. and uh, his face apparently. Let's see here. Whoa. This is cool. So we're going to buy the Yeti. And while we're at it, who else do you want to buy? Caveman? Uh, yes. Yes. So check this out. Okay. Oh, look out. Hey, polar bear. No. Will that polar bear ever attack you? Okay. Is there... So let's, <gasps> let's do his face. <laughs> what? Her hair. And... Oh, man. This is awesome. Change up that. And hands on. Blank off. Let's do the, the little sock. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and, and actually, you know what? It's on the fly, fun. loads in really quickly. Nice, For nice work, technically. And then you know we've got other things. We've got you know I can buy these now that I have them. Uh, vehicles, we can buy that. I wish I had the drill truck to show you. But. Okay. So I mean, well, let's run around. What? This is my favorite. So, you know, in certain games when you get stuck, this is their solution. I. Th uh, okay. Boop, boop. This, okay. There are some choices that are made here that are really nice. I, I honestly, I really would like to see it optimized a little bit better for PC, but... It's only been out for, what? Two? It's early access. Yeah, yeah well, it's, it's also only been out for a couple weeks. And it's very good looking, you know? And, and but see, I, I guess here's my concern. I have a very common i7 chip. Right. Um, I have 16 gigs of, like high performance corsair which is a very common brand right ram i have a samsung ssd and i have a um i have a westgate hybrid drive yeah you better get in that you better i owned that when i was little um and i have and i'm running like an nvidia 760 2 meg card so like none of what i'm working with is unusual or strange i I would think that this would be optimized. Like, I would think that the optimization process would be for the most common pieces right. of hardware. And that's something I always look for when I build, so I don't run into a situation that, that's negative. So, I, I, But again, early access, and we are running it with all the bells and whistles on. It seems to, to stay around 24 frames, which it, it may have something to do with the fact that my monitor is a 3D monitor, and it may just want to live there. So you did you just move into a different yeah, world area? And you know here you can find dragons and warlocks. So, uh, first of all, there are dragons, and you can ride a dragon, and you can go get ahead, the warlock. Get character. on with your bad self and do that. That's but no, so so the biome, the disc that you pick, is the starting area, but it's not the entirety of your world. Right. Okay. Don't fall them. Okay. And we're uh, yeah, that's a warlock. much cooler. Here's the warlock. Let's let's get him. So, like in the real world, in order to be someone, you just need to beat them up. Yes. And take their stuff. Yes. Okay, I like that. Good lesson. Let's buy him. Hopefully, I can afford him. If not. Okay, so. And we can build some stuff. Too. So lava is lava. Yeah, yeah. If you jump in that, you will die. Oh, okay. There you go. That's um, that. No, it's important that we educate our children that way. There we go. That's... Hot damn. 
And you know, I want to see. Remember, I said the detail. So let's see, let's see a little. Hold on, actually, it'd be better in in better lighting. Yeah, better right. lighting. Let's get them in better lighting. But yeah, but we can jump into lava if you want. That's not okay. Very good. And look, you got points for dying. Well, you, I lost my little oh, coinage. Boo. Oops. I seriously can't wrap my head around how pretty this game is. Like, it's it's weird to think of a LEGO game being gorgeous, but one of the things about the previous LEGO games that always sort of drove me a little bit crazy is that you've got these um, physics objects in the game that are LEGO, and you've got these characters in the games that are LEGO, but the games themselves always look not photorealistic, but, you know. Yeah, and it's it shouldn't be struggling on a system like this, so you can just deal with that. I never had that error. That's weird. Um, so yeah. you you have these settings behind it that aren't necessarily photorealistic, but look different. Yeah, you they're know, not the Lego. Lego. They're not made out of Legos. Right. This is the very first one of the Travelers games that I've seen that looks genuinely like a Lego game. What was that? You're just staring at each other. Oh, I didn't know I could do that as a warlock. Yes. Yes, you can. I am okay with that. Would you so like to the, blow up some Legos? In, no, 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 no. No, you're, you're going to run this because you're more familiar with it. You can... Okay, so each individual... I would presume then that that would indicate that certain characters have innate abilities. Like yeah, the ability... Or, or like the caveman comes with a club. You, are you trying to make that lava do things? Yeah, you are. Oh, yeah, you are. Look at the clouds! <laughs> the clouds are like, oh! Holy shit, this is a good idea. <laughs> like, Holy seriously, this is a great idea. Like, this is... Okay, we talked about this before when you were getting ready to buy this game. The I'm... Lego games to date have been, like, here's a Lego adaptation of a franchise. And, like... I don't mean that tone to come off as, like, negative or condescending, because a lot of the LEGO games have been fun. But when when someone first said there was going to be a LEGO video game, like... Start a new world, too. Yeah. This is what I expected. Well, like, I, this is what it should have been the first time. This is this is what a LEGO game should they kind of be. They kind of dropped it, too. They were like, by the way, this is out on Early yeah. Access. Go buy it. And I was like... oh. Okay. Yeah, so now I spend so much of my time just pruning PR emails, just like going through like ev like everything. Just I and I've I've almost I'm always amazed when I'm surprised by a game coming out because I I have this early warning and like I didn't even see it on Steam. Like you you bought it before I had even heard of it or saw it on Steam. Like that's how quiet they were about it. And that's, I mean, I guess it's because it's an early access title, but, like, that's crazy to me. Okay, so are all these randomly generated? Yep. Okay. And then you've got the seeds. Let's see. Uh, okay, and when you do the seed island. and you randomize it, can you enter a manual one? I think you can share it with people. I've never okay. tried that. Um, I'm hoping they're going to do multiplayer, which to me would be dumb if they didn't. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and I mean, obviously, like, I would like for them to iron out any technical issues first oh. and then introduce that later. But okay, and so this is fourteen ninety nine on Steam. Yeah, this is fourteen ninety nine. Oh shit! Woo! Plant. Can, can it's so it pretty. Too. It's, it's just it, it's just such a. It's really weird to think of a game that's built this way being this pretty. But this this is one of the prettiest games I've seen this year. Because of the way it realizes the world. Um, see. I mean, I can show you even building. Uh, yeah, 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 no, no. Cool. Again, you know more about it than I do, so you build so... what... Holy God! Let's do... Uh, I mean, building's a little difficult, like removing pieces yeah. can be kind of a pain in the ass, but actually, let's make a flat surface to work on, because, you know, it's like working with Legos on a carpet. Yeah. It's a <laughs> bad idea. Uh, so let's flatten... Oh. Uh, uh, yeah, flatten the screen. Do they? I do they? I mean, do they literally have every piece that's in current sets right now? Probably. I mean, I haven't gone through all of them because I've mainly just been derping for items and getting a giant drill truck, and driving it through mountains, and riding polar bears. So let's actually make a flat surface. It's so pretty. 
So, okay, one of the things that we do here um, at Pixel Plays is we, like, a lot of times we're picking titles based on, you know, recent releases or based on who sends out a PR email or whose game is interesting enough for them to, to I mean, for us to send them a PR email. Very rarely is it that I would point at a game and say, like, I would buy the shit out of that. But I would buy the shit out of this. My poor construction, but let's see. Let's find some more pieces. Uh, that is insane. Maybe how I'm... like how many pieces they have, the Oh, maybe I don't. So this is you know, it's funny, like there's this there's this argument that I see you just, just paint it green, just call it There's this argument that I see a lot of times with games like this and i you know i it's it's difficult to say like this because i frankly haven't seen anything quite like this but um you know a lot of parents say like i don't like it when kids play video games because when they play video games they're not doing anything they're not working with people or doing anything constructive or creating and that's i think one of the reasons why minecraft blew up was because minecraft was like it was a game but it wasn't a game. But it wasn't a game. It was like a, it was like the ability to build anything you want. It gave you this like insane level of freedom. And like to be honest with you, like three and a half years later, and like I was one of the very first alpha people. I still go back into that every once in a while and just build a castle. Just because I want to build a castle. For when kids build like I remember hearing, you know, kids be like, Oh, I built this with all these switches and I had this cool like mansion. It's like I built a hut. I did out of a wall. Out of dirt. And I had it suits me very well. There was a window, and that window was it wasn't really a window because I didn't have glass. But there was there was a hole in the wall, right? And so, like so that, I think is something that's very important to to have. And I think it's nice to see another game that's obviously of incredibly high quality because you can tell. I don't I don't love the menu. But the rest of the UI is amazing. The game is visually stunning. The level of complexity is insane. The amount of content is crazy. And it's an early access that drops out of nowhere. This is a year... Okay, so we have... You know, we have Battlefront this year. We have Fallout this year. Um, we probably have some other exciting games and I'm not terribly concerned about myself. But, like... This is going to be one of those games that's actually important in the long run. It's going to be wildly financially successful. There oh, it is. There that's it is. a drill truck. Oh, God. Thank God. And it's really technically impressive, and I'm very... And there's like, a dragon. I'm, I'm amazed getting a drill truck fight to dragon. Drill truck dragon. I'm, am, I'm amazed that it came out of nowhere. I'm amazed the price point isn't higher. This is. I would. Mm, I was not entirely certain about this. Like I watched the trailer and I thought it looked really good, but I was also a little no. suspicious. No. JJ, JJ, what did you do? Uh, Can on. you punch it? Hold on, wait. It's a vehicle in a video we, game. We, we're gonna. We're oh gonna, no, gonna, you, you got one now. You gonna. can just buy one. Why don't you try and? Yeah, that's right. That's right. Fix the terrain around it. Oh God, JJ, there's some lava there, so I'm just saying. Be careful with your bass. Oh god, lava! Can you add terrain back in underneath it to keep the lava from? Uh, <laughs> Leave it to me to find something cool and then ruin it. No. Okay, so that moment right there. No. Oh, god. <laughs> Did you just reach? <laughs> Hold on. There's a reason that this button exists. Oh, thank God. Oh, oh, boy. Where's my drill truck? I don't know. You can buy it, though, because you, you... I don't have enough it. money because I just died 30... No, oh, God. Yes, give me the drill truck. Right, now, how do I drill again? Is it space button? There we go. You can drill through lava? Yeah. Well, so are you just going to keep drilling your way into the You can ground? drill up. You can drill up, how? but I'm going to dr drill uh, down. Okay, go to town with that. So, let's get that dragon. Okay, so this... Re this doesn't have multi who's in the clouds i'm i'm a warlock hanging out in the clouds just cause because i'm a video game okay so tonight tonight's theme 
which which I loved. Um, between cat lateral damage and this, was that it's okay to not be serious because I'm a motherfucking video game. And in a time where we're having games that don't work at launch, and yeah, and super. Can a name him? Can a pet his little pretty dragon face? How do you? Uh, oh. And since it's a dragon. That's it, man. That's it. I'm done. I'm sold. Oh my god, he breathes fire. There's a spooky forest where there are vampires and other creatures. Um, this I is found so candy good. Land. I found. Um, what else? I mean. Just a lot of weird random. Oh, okay, so all they need to do is put co-op in this. I think. W yep. Just yeah, just put that's it. Put co-op in this. I mean, you know, iron out whatever technical issues remain. Put co-op in this, and this looks amazing. Let's see if we can find some monsters. You got tombstones. You got little lanterns. Skeletons, jack o' lantern, Lego, right there. Um, ooh, a chest. I think that's a chest. No, it's a hut. We can build the hut later. But yeah. I just, I, uh... Wow. There's a vampire. Let me see. No, this game, it, it, it <laughs> blows my mind of just. <coughs> I don't. Yeah, I like that because there was there was a part there where they were thinking about showing you a cutscene, but it was too late because he had already exploded. Oh, oh get back here, goat! Go, you can ride the goat. Goat! Die on me, goat! Yes. I enjoy that because that goat is outrageously small to be an option. <laughs> this is this is my new this is my new favorite game of all time. You guys did. Holy shit! This is awesome. Cause you think, oh, it's just this. No, but there's now like a lot more of this. Like, right, oh wait, there's a set. Ah! Oh, I didn't realize it. So let's just boop that right there. Wait, no, this is like a Lego set that you can like. It's like a, it's like a whole thing. What? The, yeah. Holy Jesus, God, this is cool. Uh, I'm just generic. What dude. up, guy? You just hanging out? Yeah. Flannel dude, hipster, I guess. Mm, I mean, we could. You could set him on fire. I Maybe. could. Or. No, I don't have enough because I kept dying. <sighs> Do you want to go in the house? It's, duh, yes. Okay, what can I interact with? Okay, so n n is this your house now? Do you. What were you just doing to that? Oh, okay, gotcha. All right. Yeah, yeah. He's, I've I, never, I've never done this house thing. I've come across other people's houses. And I've gone inside. You now have a house that you. What's the inside like? I don't know. I just, <laughs> <laughs> just you know, hanging out. Oh, on... technically he's supposed to be waving out the window, but. Yeah. So alpha. So, so that's alpha. Oh. Okay, so when you're doing that, this is this is really the big question, like deep in my heart. Can you like cannonball and like blow a bunch of shit up when you land? Like, what happens if you? <laughs> this is the. I okay, so this is what's gonna happen. We are gonna play this game a lot, and we're not gonna look up anything that you can do, how to do anything, any features, any details, and we're just gonna let this game surprise us a okay. lot. Let's just claim this. What are you? Are you claiming? I th are, are, it looks like you're peeing. Is, no. is that water or are you, you're paint. painting it? Oh, it's painting. This is easily the coolest freaking thing I've seen there in games. Go. Like, okay, so. <laughs> now let's get let's go back to Minecraft for a second because like seriously like that that's something that this is like closely associated with in a deep way but like it's important to change things and to do things differently and maybe do things better it's it's important to not just 
rest on your laurels and it's important to innovate. I'm having trouble thinking of anything that does what this does the way that this does it. I think it it, it came out at the right time. I mean, there's still the Minecraft craze. I don't think they're going to lose too many Minecraft players. Well, Honestly, I, I think more adults were like, holy crap, a Lego game that's not... Oh. I also don't think it's a direct competitor. No, I think this like, is them doing their own thing. Yeah, I, I don't... I wouldn't... Look at you. Look at you just crawling around walls doing whatever spider And it would be cool to see, like, licensed things, you know. Yeah. And they said no, no microtransactions for oh. now, but... Oh, I got a club. No, that's... See, that that was where I was going to go, is... So, is this a thing where it's 15 bucks, but if you want this set... From what I read, This template, this tablet, you have to... So far in early... Ooh, desert. You know, there won't be any microtransactions. But I would I think I even would shell out a couple of bucks for like It depends the, on like, what it is. Yeah. Like Pirates build yeah. space uh, set. You know? Like Space Pirates Knights. Space Pirates Knights. You I you, mean they've already brought back the actual pi or pirate set physically. You can buy that old set. Um This is this crazy so crazy cool. So pretty. We have enough money? No, we don't. Oh wait, this is a bad guy? And you know what? I guess that's what... Oh, he's a bad guy. I guess that's what happens when... <clears throat> first of all, I don't... Lego has gone through, like, a massive renaissance. And the main reason it has is because it moved to different management. Um, it, was, it was being... In the opinion of the shareholders, it was being mismanaged for a, a very long time. And they recently changed management. And that was around the time you started seeing things shift into different directional sets came back. Um, there were different things that were available to purchase. They started moving out into different licensing realms. I know they started um, like making. They made a new rule of like make sets with the pieces we have, yeah, so we don't you have to make more. No, yeah, no, no more, no more weird custom pieces. Um, and that was not totally contemporaneous with the like the licensing to traveler's tales but it was like that happened just a little bit after the first of those occurred and they've seen a swing a, a massive upswing the whole reason uh, that they were concerned is because for a little bit there they were actually losing share which is a weird idea because lego has been the most popular toy, toy since it yeah, yeah since it launched um and it's the toy you can just keep handing down like i yeah. had my brother's space sets yeah you know like it's just the There's, toy that it's timeless yeah it it will it will never age um and we've seen we've seen a lot of like positive things happen with the brand licensing lately um and so you know maybe this is just maybe this is just what happens when lego finally decides to like really seriously commit to a title is this a pc exclusive i think so and you remember the that, camel that you wanted yeah there's your derpy camel Boo, what are you doing i'm jumping like a camel does i'm doing camel things jumping like a... i so just can't find it, fault i mean the controls are a little weird and yeah. it's not optimized but it's early access and no one, no one knew it was coming, and it's been out for like what, like a week? Yeah, and, and honestly, the first time I <laughs> booted this game up, I oh wait, actually, I need to steal that card because that's a, a rat rod or a hot rod. So I've been um with a gun from that explorer set. This is so badass. This is. Oh my god. Okay, so it's it's important to remember, like in especially like just post E three, that like triple A isn't necessarily where everything is. And I think that's one of the the reasons why all of the Pixel Plays guys move towards PC is because triple A can be really disappointing. Um it's it can be the same thing just year after year after year, you know, I'm not gonna name any names but Call of Duty. Um and we we get really tired of that. Like we don't want to spend our money on that. No, um, innovation is what's what's interesting. Like people that love, 
there are people that play video games and there are people that love video games and people that love video games want something new and that's one of the reasons why minecraft got me and then ftl got me um and like it it's nice when it isn't just the same damn thing all the time like i know that everybody this week is talking about batman well, they're angry with it, with good reason. And right, well, the PC guys are angry with it, and everybody that owns it on console thinks it's the second coming of Jesus Christ. But, like, here's the deal. I, you know, I have the three others, and I liked them a lot. You know, I thought, I thought Rocksteady did a really good job with its two, and I thought Origins wasn't as bad as everybody said it was. Um, I mean, I didn't think it was great, but... I didn't really care that the pc port was crappy and now part of that has something to do with the fact that they just they really botched the hell out of the dlc in that like they they basically were just yes um they basically were just screwing people but like it's more important to me to have something new and interesting than to have another really good thing like un uncharted was amazing and uncharted 2 was like great and by the time uncharted 3 came around i was like excited for it but it i didn't feel the same way about it because the first one was so good so then the last of us comes out and that's not pivotally different on a lot of deep ways it's still it's still deep. mechanic it's still, wise though yeah mechanically it's, it's similar but that's more exciting because it's new and because it's different and so when batman came out that was really exciting and when it's the first comic book game we got that didn't suck right and then when the second one came out it was like cool. you had this idea of expectation and so by the time we get to the, the to this one i just don't i don't i don't care that you're screwing me on dlc because i'll buy the game of the year version i don't care that the pc port is shitty because by the time the game of the year version comes out you'll have fixed it for pc i don't care because i'm not that excited about it's nice when something comes out of nowhere and really surprises you and this is an amazing example of that because what you're doing right now is running from biome to biome as a warlock with a blunderbuss jumping in a baja buggy getting ready to run i was shit hoping to find a mini sub but... right what no there, there's submarines and there's, <gasps> there's little dinghies that you can yeah use so uh... th that moment that's what i want out that's what i want out of games because that doesn't happen anymore. Like once you once you play enough of them, you know what to expect. You understand the design paradigm. You understand how things work. And you don't have that moment you go, wait, what? I can do that? Like for me, I loved I loved The Last of Us, but I had this weird feeling like it, it felt too much like Uncharted. I mean yeah. different game you know, mechanics on that, but it's just control wise. Yeah. I was like, Okay, so I can't jump anymore. That's what you took away, but everything else feels the same and yeah. some of the mechanics. Like I still love the game, but it was still the same to me. Well, yeah, yeah and, and that's what I mean. It's like, it, AAA is AAA. And one of the reasons I wanted, I, I like using Uncharted and Last of Us in, as an example is because that's as good as AAA gets. You know, you don't, you don't get better presentation, visual quality, narrative than those games. Like, it, it, I, I would hold those up against anything in the industry as an example of how to best do what you're doing. But sometimes AAA just isn't that exciting anymore because it's not innovative. And that's why indie is the future. That's why everybody blew up over Minecraft. That's why everybody freaked out over FTL. And um, No Man's Sky. And that's, yeah, right. That's why everyone is currently freaking out over No Man's Sky is because indie developers have the ability to, out of absolutely nowhere do whatever they want, make creative decisions because nobody's telling them that the almighty dollar rules everything. Now, we're playing a Lego game. It's the best-selling toy in the world. This is not indie. Traveler's Tales has built like a, tr like a tremendous number of licensed games over the last couple of years, and all of them good. Um... But they've done something I'm having trouble wrapping my head around. It's not AAA. It's a $15 Steam Early Access release. 
but it it is Lego backing Traveler's Tales. Well, like how did they do this? <laughs> how did they, I mean it came out and I'm yeah. I'm amazed. And I would assume WB's involved just because WB owns that. And that's my only fear. It's yeah. Is, see, and that that's it right there. That's one of the because, reasons why earlier I wanted to ask the question about early access because. WB has the worst track record with DLC of any pre-order pay, you know, like limitations and things like that. And just, I mean, like you said with Batman, I too was like, okay, cool, I'm gonna wait. Uh, I'll get the game of the year, so I can get all the DLC and not have to decide which store I'm gonna get it from because I'm really sick and tired of that. Over that. And I mean, pre-order bonuses are shitty, but pre like, like even with Halo, retailer specific pre-order bonuses are the worst. The thing I liked with Halo, they're like, yeah, there's gonna be certain things that you get in the collector's edition, limited edition. But you can unlock that in the main game, yeah. no matter what version you have. Yeah. So that's how to do. That's that. how you do it. Yeah. Maybe, maybe give the incentive of, hey, you spend a little more money. Maybe you should have something cool right away. Fine, whatever. But yeah. don't make it so I can never ever get yeah, that that's, piece of content. That's stupid because, like, at the end of the day, you are in a business. You have a product to sell. You want to make sure that that product is as appealing as possible to the broadest number of people. You're going to turn a lot of people off if you say you have to buy it from this retailer. You're, you're going to turn a lot of people off if you say you have to buy it at launch. You, 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 it's okay to do that, what you're talking about, to, to incentivize early adopt. That's a seaplane. Uh, <laughs> we just talk about the moon is setting. The, and that's a Lego moon. It's a Lego moon. You can moon. see that. So that means the Lego sun... It's about to come up over. Should be. No, that's no, the opposite of where that I came know. up from. Yeah. Wait. Google goodness. Hi, camel. <gasps> Ooh, the camel is like, hey, what you doing? Lego sunrise. Hi. See, look at that cape, though. Look at that texture. And there's a camel who are like, hey, buddy, did you need a ride somewhere? Don't worry, I don't spit on things. Is that a fishing pole? Can I use it? No. Would you like me to get in the sea plane? I would like you to get in the... Can, you, you can feel free to beat up that skeleton first. That's or, a yeti. That's a yeti. Why is there... <clears throat> don't worry. Oh, it's a helicopter. I'm sorry. That is an aquatic helicopter. Oh my god! This game is... All well, right. Let's talk about this. So, desert. Uh, we've got more desert. Different type. And then we've got ocean. And then we have a little snow patch with a yeti. Can you land in the water on that? Yeah. Okay, so I th I think, honestly, like, we've done about everything that we need to do in this game um, as a stream. Um, I've... I have never been so impressed by something I didn't expect to be impressed by because yeah in the beginning you were kind of like eh. well i mean that's the thing like when when you hear about the idea of like a, a lego minecraft like it's well a duh and b well it's going to be you know it's going to be good but it's not going to be great unless they really genuinely dedicate themselves to execution and barring some technical issues which i am happy to attribute to early access this is amazing like this is not this is not good this is not cool this is this is amazing this is a, a phenomenal technical achievement it's absolutely gorgeous it's a lot deeper than i would have expected it to <laughs> and basically every every five minutes or so something like this happens that's just hilarious and awesome it, it honestly reminds me of playing with legos yeah like which is exactly what it should be and when you don't have any more room for storing all your legos this game's kind of perfect yeah well and not no only that up after it's you. you like unless you want to spend like unless you'd like to like you know spend re all your money renegotiate the mortgage on your house legos aren't legos aren't cheap legos are ridiculously expensive and this gives you access to things you wouldn't have other this is the most incredibly pleasant surprise of this year 
and possibly for like a really long day. Are you? Did you just pave paradise and put up a parking lot? Is that what you just did? All right. In any case, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Um, we really appreciate your time. You can pave the ocean. Is what you can. You you keep driving that shit. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so much for tuning in. My name is James Honeycutt. I'm JJ Crass. And we'll see you guys next week. <laughs>